the business sustainability business excellence award is uh, dabur india limited dabur india limited is committed and well on course to become the first indian plastic waste neutral enterprise uh, by the end of this fiscal by collecting processing recycling over 22000 metric tons of post consumer plastic waste dabur's efforts have led to the creation of local and green jobs adaptation of better technologies improvement in lives of informal workers with notable positive social environmental and economic impact as a responsible corporate citizen dabur has always been recognized for its commitment towards sustainability and ecological responsibility dabur has been has taken many progressive actions to reduce plastic waste in cities while also raising awareness about plastic waste management across the nation and different countries of the world recording I, stopped we have uh, the the mr tushar patnaik the corporate head ehs india and sar countries and also plastic waste management dabur india limited recording in progress virtually uh, here and also share his remarks on the program so mr tushar patnaik welcome and honor to have you thank you mr akram this policy times uh, really it's a great honor for us that giving that sustainability award recording stopped that is the sustainability award we a company of dabur who has done uh, extensively in the work of epr for the last 3 to 4 years and also and many thanks to our all the speakers and dignitaries we are present in this virtual conference i can say this is really very good that's policy time since time to time organizing some very 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 fruitful conferences and inviting people from various stakeholders from government sector private sector and other sector recyclers wma ulbs this is really i can say okay because it's a collaboration of four fronts we need people from government side people from ulb people from recyclers people from brand owners and other stakeholders and with the collaboration efforts of all the people we can do the whatever the epr recording in progress road map has been done for uh, 2021 the current notification recording stop we will we'll discuss on that part before going to start up the session again i can say today the day where we are organizing such a conferences on related to epr on various sector whether the uh, policy times or many of the sector is organizing such a conferences why today we are organizing such kind of conferences just go back to the five years back so if it uh, if it would have been in the year of 2015 nobody was asking and nobody was telling about waste if it would have a conference of less three days the waste solid waste management or maybe a plastic waste management will last day of the session but today it is very very important session and everybody is talking about this plastic waste because that means the role of the sector is now coming everybody in the same platform and to fulfill the indians uh, what is the indian road map going forward for the next 10 to 20 years and also being a global leader our prime minister mr narendra modi in the swachh bharat mission in the un everybody is talking that india is working and we have taken a three target will will so because this new rule notification of 6th of october 2021 which is coming out it is not only talking about the upstream epr it is also talking about the downstream epr epr is continuously doing by the many of the brand owners for the last three years now it is only focusing on the three r approach reduce plastic recycle plastic and recycle plastic content everything it is talking about upstream and downstream so the road map for, for the future road map is convert the challenges to opportunities second is reduction of virgin plastics and focus on recyclable plastics because unless you reduce the virgin plastics then the environment the pollution will never be decreased so focus on the new notification is very good on the recyclable plastics thrust and mono material structure why thrust and mono material structure while you go for the recycling you have a material of one type 
not be if you are contained of a bottle of HD, PP, PVC. So it's very difficult to recycle the thrust and monomaterial structure. Embedding reusable systems in consumption. Reusable systems is practically at present. I don't know in globally also, I have discussed with many people. It is very, very challengeable how in India the reusable systems in kind of rigid plastic, rigid plastic, and we'll see as per the notification that is also a challenge. Reduction of unwanted plastics in packaging material. Promote alternative plastics because single use of plastic has already been from 1st July 2022. So we have to come out with the alternate source of plastics and awareness for source of segregation. These are the key areas where in the coming days, it will uh, be a part where we have to unite together in the single pattern. With this, I uh, finished my session. Thank you. Sir. Thank you.